Hi, in this video, we'll set up our very first monitor using the Distill Chrome extension. First, to install the Distill Chrome extension, head over to the Chrome Web Store and search for Distill Web Monitor. Click on Add to Chrome button. Click Add Extension. You will see a blue droplet icon appear here. To pin Distill to easily access it while setting up monitors, click on the extension icon here and the pin button next to the Distill Web Monitor. This should pin Distill to your browser tray. Now, let's set up our first monitor. The first step here would be to navigate to the page that you want to track. Then, click on the droplet icon here. Here, you have the option to either monitor the full page or parts of the page. In my case, I want to monitor parts of the page. The visual selector opens up. This is a tool that allows you to make selections on the portions of the page that you want to track. In my case, I want to track the price section, so I will use my mouse to just click and make selections on the page. You can see that the selection has been made when a black box surrounds the page area that you want to track. Use the caret button to open up more options, which allows you to expand your area of selection, contract, and delete selections. Once you have made your selection, verify that it is the same by checking it in the preview. When you are done, click on Save Selection. This takes you to the Options page. Here, you can configure your monitor. You can choose the device on which you want to run checks on. By default, it is set to Google Chrome as we have used the Chrome extension. Here, you can schedule intervals at which the web page will be checked. In our case, we will set the check interval to one hour. As long as the browser is open, Distill will keep checking the page every hour. You can use the Add Action button to set up the alert mode through which you want to receive change notifications. The availability of some options depends on your subscription plan. You also have the option to add conditions. Adding conditions ensures that you get alerts only when the detected change meets the condition criteria. Let's go ahead and add our condition here. I'll click on Add Condition. Here, since I am tracking the price section, I will set up the condition that the text that I am tracking, that is the price, has number less than 900. If you remember, our laptop was priced at $929. Now, whenever there is a change in the price and it is less than $900, I will get an alert. In other cases, I will not get change alerts. Once you are done configuring the monitor, click on Save. Now, your first monitor has been set up and it will appear in your watch list. Distill runs the monitor right after the setup and keeps running it at the set check interval. Now, let us take a look at how the change history is recorded. I have another monitor that I set up earlier. This was tracking the price section on another web page. You can click on the text preview of the monitor to open the change history. You can see that the price has been highlighted in green when it has changed. You can click on Explore Diff to further compare and navigate through changes. The deleted text is in red and the newly added text is in green. I hope this video gave you an idea of how to set up your Distill Chrome extension